Alrighty, here we go. This is the video for the TM2's accelerometer a demo. Um, I'm going to do this to show off at least how functional it is at the moment. Um, and for those that didn't know where the system tray icon is, it looked like that, right? There. Hold on, let the focus. Come on. There. Right next to the battery. Looks like a synchronizing uh, arms or something. Arrows. Um, okay. So for basic, uh, all I have to do is lift up. It can't rotate if it's lying down. Um, just so it doesn't ac accidentally rotate by itself or you're reading something else. And whoops, whoops, you don't want that to happen. So you need to lift it up enough and then rotate. There we go. Bada boom. See, it rotated. So I missed it's on the bottom. Rotate back. I'm just going to press this stupid wireless button again. It's a little buggy at times, but... Oh, crap. Right when the demo. There it goes. Um, it does full 360. Oop, I think it's going to record while holding the camera. There we go. Let's try to zoom out more. I guess I can't. Again. It's pretty functional. Um, wow, perfect timing to say that. Sometimes you just hit in the corner when it's like this, uh, when the logo's on the bottom. It can kind of get a little... It's a little buggy at the moment, but otherwise functional. Um, I was going to show... Is if you zoom up on the zoom on the sync icon, you can easily disable it by tapping it. Enable, disable, exit, whatever. Um, what else? Pretty simple program. Not really using them to face. At the moment, at least. Because not really need to have one. Like I said, just rotate and it rotates with you. Again, you don't have to yank it around like someone else said. That was kind of sensitive at the moment. Um, what else? Am I missing anything else? Uh, I don't think so. Works fine for me. Just a little sensitive. I can fix that later though. Uh, well, this has been a quick demo of the TM2's accelerometer program I developed for uh, myself and others. Hope you like it.